used by a wide variety of industries to seal all types of flanges, the linebacker sealing gasket is considered one of the best methods to ensure zero environmental leakage of almost any type of fluid flowing through any type of flanged piping system. The same unique sealing design is used for constructing small diameter gaskets like these to massive seals upwards of 144 inches in diameter like this one used on a large diameter water line in the western United States. The sealing concept of the linebacker is based on a quad ring, a rectangular seal element positioned in a groove with a slight incline facing toward the pipe barrel. As the flange faces come together, the sealing element is compressed sideways, forcing it into the void area up the incline. By precisely controlling the void volume ratio when firm contact is made between the gasket retainer and flange face, total encapsulation of the sealing element is achieved. Only micro exposure of the seals to any external or internal environment protects them from deterioration by both atmospheric conditions and internal media. The linebacker is also energized by pressurized fluid flowing from the pipe barrel up to the sealing element. Notice how this fluid flows along the retainer to the seal element, forcing it up against the flange face. This strengthens sealing element flange face contact for a more effective seal. We'll use a gasket tester to demonstrate the effectiveness of the linebacker gasket versus a flat gasket, each with 15 foot-pounds of torque applied to the flange nuts. First, a typical asbestos substitute flat gasket. The gasket is installed on the tester, positioned over the studs much like a flange. The clear platen is installed on top of the gasket for viewing when pressurized fluid is introduced into the center of the gasket. Nuts with washers are installed on the studs to secure the clear platen and apply clamp load to the gasket. A torque wrench set at 15 foot-pounds is used in a crossing pattern to uniformly tighten the nuts. A water-soluble cutting solution is pumped into the center of the gasket to simulate fluid flowing inside a pipe flange. Watch the gauge carefully. Notice how the pressure barely rises before numerous leak paths are detected migrating across the gasket face. This gasket has failed miserably, and understandably so, seeing as we only applied 15 foot-pounds of torque to the nuts holding the gasket in the tester. A normal flat gasket would require massive amounts of torque, enough to actually crush the gasket in an attempt to hold 800 PSI. But that's exactly the point, as we'll now demonstrate how the linebacker will easily hold over 800 pounds of pressure with the same torque applied to the flange nuts. First, a few notes on the linebacker gasket. The linebacker is labeled as to the brand of the gasket, the material makeup, in this case phenolic retainer with nitrile seal element, pipe size, and pressure rating. The gasket is also date stamped. With the wide variety of linebacker retainer and seal elements available, these designations will ensure the correct gasket is installed for the intended application. The linebacker gasket is installed in the tester in the same manner as the flat gasket. By the way, did we mention that the linebacker sealing gasket is manufactured in accordance to ISO quality assurance specifications? It's your guarantee the linebacker is manufactured according to a specific quality assurance program that is monitored and subject to periodic audit by an independent third-party certification board. On close inspection, you may begin to notice the seal element enlarge against the clear platen, even when the nuts are hand-tightened.
This is exaggerated now as the nuts are torqued to 15 foot-pounds. The sealing element is now being compressed into the retainer groove. You'll notice the solution migrating across the retainer up to the sealing element as we start pumping. The solution makes an abrupt stop there. We'll keep pumping until an internal pressure of 800 PSI is reached. That's the limit of the clear plexiglass platen. If we were to install a metal platen, we could apply as much as 10,000 PSI to a standard 150 pound ANSI class gasket with no environmental leakage. The limitations of the test are based on the test unit and not the gasket. To demonstrate more graphically the effectiveness of the linebacker sealing gasket, we'll remove one of the four nuts. Watch the pressure drop slightly due to increased internal volume between the gasket and clear platen. More importantly, you'll note there is still no leakage across the gasket face. In fact, we can re-tighten the nut and the pressure will increase, as the seal was actually never broken, even with one nut removed. For over 30 years, linebacker sealing gaskets have been used to seal flanges in long-distance transmission lines, complex piping systems within refineries, chemical plants, and process piping systems, and for pipe connections associated with extremely large diameter water systems. The product is well tested and proven. Customers worldwide rely on the linebacker to ensure trouble-free service for the life of their system. They also rely on the linebacker as a high-quality dielectric isolator used not only for sealing flanges, but also electrically isolating pipe sections. In fact, the linebacker is most frequently specified as part of corrosion mitigation hardware in the form of high-quality flange insulation kits. Significant material improvements have led to the development of the Linebacker Zero, the Linebacker 250, and the Linebacker 251, three important additions to the PSI line. These gaskets address the regulations associated with asbestos substitute gaskets and fugitive emissions, requirements that are closely monitored and highly sensitive to regulatory agencies today.